Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Dalizu. I'd like to just say a few things about how to make house chores less lonely. I don't like house chores because they take quite a bit of time and in that time I'm all by myself and then I spend so much time going in my own head about all the bills I have to pay and the child who's giving me a hard time, the person who was gossiping about me and the other person who doesn't like how my uh, whatever, whatever it is that's not going well for them and maybe the other person who has not called me in a long time. Okay. So the best thing, I should get something to occupy my mind while I'm cleaning. So what I do, if I'm not watching a preaching, then I watch a documentary. Now it's not about watching, it's more like, um, like podcasts work very well because you don't have to watch them, you're just, you're listening to them. Some people have to have music, for me music is nice, but um, I prefer the documentaries and something to make me feel like I am meditating and having that uh, me time with my mind or now if it, it can double up as uh, you know like as uh, devotion time so that I have read maybe I've read my I've done my morning devotion and then after that I can have um, pastor who is preaching about that devotion that I had, whatever topic it was. Then, of course, we have uh, uh, documentaries. I like Lucy Wosley. She has nice documentaries. I'll link her channels, the channels for her documentaries uh, in the description box below if you're interested in those kinds of things. Me, I'm a history nerd, so I love those history documentaries. Think about the end of the chore okay for example if i'm cooking i have to cook a whole bag of chapatis in my house otherwise it's not enough i have four children and three of them are boys and boys eat chapati so i have to make sure that i i cook a whole packet otherwise they'll feel like they ate but they didn't quite enjoy so what i do is i set the table you know i decorate the table and I set each person's place and uh, the table is now looking good, ready for the chapati meal that we're going to have. Then you involve them in making the meal. If there's going to be kachumbari, there's someone cutting up things. Then if there's going to be some juice or some lemonade, there's someone squeezing those. And in the end, you find that the task not only finishes faster, but you don't spend a lot of time getting upset at how long it's taking and how tired you're feeling. Sometimes your feet are killing you while you're making those chapatis, but in the end, you end up enjoying the meal after. The, what, what children don't like is mom has cooked, but now she has cooked, she's upset. She doesn't want even to join us, she doesn't want to sit with us, she leaves us eating by ourselves, and after that she's complaining about clearing up, clearing up. I think to have a peaceful home, there are some Make up your mind not to complain about some things. Like, don't um, make, if there's something you don't have to complain about, just find a way to solve it instead of complaining. I remember the other day I was uh, listening to a, a someone who was, te was uh, giving advice on how to motivate, motivate your teenager if they're feeling overwhelmed by, you know, this life and and studies and such things. And I felt that was something useful for me because I have three teenagers now and uh, one of them became a, a prefect in class and now she doesn't want it anymore. And I told her, you've been given a position of re leadership and it's a good opportunity to learn many things in life. But I needed the words to make her feel like it's a good opportunity to learn things um, by when you're a prefect. Um, oh, we'll see how that goes. But 
make it interesting for you so that even the children will be interested in it. If they find you're not enjoying it, how will they be interested to help you? Why should they join this boring practice of everyday dishes? So I hope that gives you an idea of what you can be doing to make your chores more interesting. A lot of people like music. There is one I saw who has a dishwashing and wine. I don't take wine, but I thought that's interesting making dishwashing like a party and some you some have uh, dishwashing and old music like old school music so that they can remember what they used to dance to back in the day um, as somebody else makes videos when they feel very unmotivated they make videos of themselves washing dishes just to feel like somebody else is watching you can stream uh you can facetime with your friend when they're wash washing those dishes you wash together and you facetime and you talk about it together and you have a, a, a work buddy yeah and then there's all these other clean with me videos which you can use from the internet thank you uh, see you in the next video. I hope you watch uh, my cleaning videos in on this channel. They're not very many, but they, they give you the idea of how I work it out. <laughs> Thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe so that we can have fun together on this channel. And tell me what things you do to make yourself more interested in your... Um, house chores, housework, I mean cooking, what is being boring over there that you want to to do, That how do you make it less boring? Thanks for watching.